Hi YouTube, how are you doing and welcome back to a game that we have not played in a long time. This is Ghost Hunter's Core. This is another ghost hunting game. And in this one, you actually kind of fight the ghosts. You exercise them, you have weapons that can beam them out of existence when they're hunting. It's uh, a really interesting game. Uh, and it has recently, well recently, I say recently, because I haven't played this game in so long. It seems recent, but it's actually been like more than a month that it's gotten a huge update where they added a new map, new visuals. Uh, and a whole bunch of other stuff that we're just gonna check out. We haven't played this game in way too long, so we're just gonna crash this slide. We're just gonna have a fun time. I really hope you join me. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike this like, but let's not waste any more time. And let's hop into Ghost Hunter's Core. Okay, there, I was like, how do you drop an item? Let's go to the new map, shall we? The new map is the... Uh, wait, there's actually two new maps, isn't there? There's the Japan, which we actually check out. There's the, there's the Barony, and then there's the camp. There's also a camp map here. Uh, I think I want to check out the camp. Let's check out the camp. Check out this map. We're going to do it on a simple, short investigation. Just to get a taste of the new map, we're going to go to uh, a few maps if we can beat it. Because this game is very, very difficult. Uh, you might die. I might die. <laughs> Let's just go. Let's check it out. Here we go. We'll get the heart attacks. Oh, the volumetric lighting, though. Here we are. It is the camp. Oh, the frame drops. Don't drop frames, please. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! That's not good. Anyway, here we are. We are on uh, Camp Hope, it said, I think. We have a lot of equipment at our disposal. We can also spawn in our own equipment. Uh, I'm gonna start with a Mary statue and a crucifix. These are your vital tools to protect yourself. Uh, if you don't have one of these tools when the ghost is hunting, you are very likely to get killed. Uh, so we're first wanna, we first wanna look around, try and find where the ghost is, then we can bring in the tools to figure out. So basically, let me, before I even hop in here, let me quickly run you past the uh, mechanics of this game, because I might have not, like I haven't played this game in such a long time, you might not remember. Uh, in this game, you use the evidence tools uh, to learn what kind of exorcism you have to do. So you go here, uh, let's say that you get EMF5, uh, and, uh, shadow, which is unrelated. The shadow you can see based on the model. Basically, that's how you figure out what ghost it is. You figure it out based off of the ghost model itself. Like, how it looks like. Uh, and then you get, let's say we get a shadow with, like, um, spirit box EVP. Then you get an exorcism based on the evidences that you found and the ghost type itself. And then if you exercise the ghost, it is deleted from the map and you have won. So that is how you do it. I played this game quite a bit, actually. But I am not very good at it anymore. Let's, uh, let's find out if we can win. Is there any ghost here? Ooh. Played on this map, like, once. Oh, I just got turned around. I think you can turn these light on, these lights on. Oh, that is very bright. Like, the lighting is very good in this game. I think the polygons could use some work. Also, the frame drops. Let me quickly check my settings, because the frame drops are... A uh, little unfortunate. Okay, we're gonna go on standard, not standard plus. Oh no, we're just gonna turn the FPS limit to 60. That should fix everything. There we go. That should fix it all, right? Hopefully. Where's a ghost? There's no breaker in this one, so we can just turn on as many lights as we want. Hello? Anyone here? We're looking for a sign of a ghost. You can just kind of see them running around sometimes. Uh, that's what you're looking for. And then they can, they can they can run around the map a lot. They are very aggressive in this game. Now I'm playing on a somewhat easy difficulty. Look at these plants. They're just flat textures. <laughs> it is very creepy. Any ghosts? I'm holding out the crucifix for protection. I also have a Mary statue. Basically, different types of ghosts are repelled by different types of equipment. The uh, demon, poltergeist, and shadow are uh, cast or like repelled by the crucifix. And the child and the revenant are repelled by the... There's a light on here. I think this light is always on. Um, the child and the revenant are repelled by the Mary statue. And it only works when you drop it on the ground. 
I think this light's always on. I don't think you can turn this off. So the ghost is not actually here. Hello? It's sometimes hard to find the ghost in this game. They tend to come to you a lot. Come to me! Attack me! What the fuck was that noise? Who was playing a violin over here? Oh, we have not seen a single sign of a ghost. Are there birds chirping or is that real life? I think that was in the game. I love the ambience. There's even a graveyard here. Spooky. Is there any ghosts in this building? Or maybe it's maybe the ghost is not here. Maybe we're safe. I don't think we are. There's tools you can use to find the ghost. Uh, I guess I'll grab one of those tools. It's very difficult to do that. Or very dangerous to do that. Because if you don't have the crucifix. When the ghost is uh, like repelled by the crucifix. You might just. Straight up die. I just heard a noise. Is it here? Is it raining? Hello? Let's talk on a tail. Or chair. <gasps> what the fuck? It's a lady! Get out of here! Okay. We found it! Wait, it's attacking me through the door? I'm gonna let run. Okay, it left. We know now that it's a shadow model. That's all I wanted to know. So now I know that I don't need the Mary statue. So now we can have one inventory slot open for a for an equipment uh, that doesn't like we we need the crucifix to protect ourselves from this ghost. So right there, you saw it was actually attacking me. Like it was trying to kill me. If I wouldn't have had this crucifix. I would have died there with barely anything I could do. You need to have a crucifix. That is one of my... This is one of the main things that I dislike about the gameplay loop of this game. Is that you're either... There's like... no. It's very binary. You're either completely safe if you have a crucifix. Or you're just absolutely fucked and dead if you don't have a crucifix. There's no like in between. There's no... Oh, I, I, I did a clutch escape. There's just a... No, you die unless you have a crucifix. In which case, you're safe. Um, so that's the one thing... And I hope they eventually work on it in this game to have more of a, like, uh, a spectrum of failure rather than it just being you either win completely or you lose completely. Uh, let's grab a photo cam, shall we? And we can actually grab one extra item that we can just drag along. So we have uh, an extra one now, an extra inventory slot, basically. It wasn't this building, right? This one? I don't know if the ghost is still here. It could have moved. Wait, was it here? No, it wasn't here. <gasps> it's over here. On this path. There's a the little house right there. Yeah, this one. This is an EMF raider, yes. I am dragging it along to the building. There's still a ghost here. Aha! We have found the ghost room, which is where we might have to do some kind of uh, invest, or we might have to do a parts of the exorcism here. This is the dread room, which is basically the ghost room. We might have to do some stuff here. I'm just gonna leave. Well, I guess I could take a photo of the ghost. Where did it go though? Is it still here? Hello, come to me. Come to me, ghost. Oh, it's here. Where? Is it in the building? Your your camera starts glitching out if the ghost is near. 
I have no idea. I don't see anything. I come exercise you. You can piss the ghost off by saying these kind of things. All right, where did you go? Are you back here? This game is spooky. Why is it raining only when you're in this house? That's so strange. Uh, yeah, I don't actually know where this ghost is. Where did you go? Come back to me. Come to me. I come extra. There it is. Drop it. Grab this. Drop it. Grab this. Ooh, I'm gonna drop this. And use the EMF on it. EMF 2, that's not EMF. Okay, so there's not gonna be EMF. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna leave that here. And we're gonna go back to the truck. So we know it's not EMF. We have found the dread room. And now we need to collect some more evidences. We also know that's a shadow. I didn't know- don't know if I even said that, but that's a shadow model. Uh, so we know we're dealing with a shadow here. Yeah, the crucifix is very strong against shadows. So you can- you continually have to keep swapping them out. So the- the thing with- I- is that still a ca is that still the case? That if your crucifix runs out, you don't get the money back? I don't know. I'm just gonna keep spawning in crucifixes. Because you need to keep swapping them out. Because they have a durability. If they get used up, you, uh... Like, they, they disappear and then the ghost can just attack you. You're not actually safe in the truck. The ghost can come all the way to the truck and beat down this door here. Um, but as long as there's a door, you're safe. But as soon as that door is broken down, you can get killed right here in the truck. That's, uh, <laughs> it's pretty spooky. Okay. We're gonna drag another item along as well. We're gonna grab the spirit box. So efficient. Oh, I accidentally threw it. Didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I fucking dropped my spirit box. Because I jumped. <laughs> You bitch! Is the ghost still here? Wish I could make it a little brighter up in here. It would be a lot more comfortable. Okay. Hello? I come exercise you! There's a, a cult reading. High occult reading here. Is that because the ghost room is here? Or is that because we're dealing with a cursed item? How high are the reading for cursed items again? I think it's just because of the cursed room. So the occult reading right there, uh, the higher that is... You can find cursed items in this game, which is actually one of my favorite mechanics of this game. I think we're gonna do that here. Um, you can find items that have like special cursed like, air, like uh, aura around them or something. And you can then take those to the truck and bring those back from the mission. And you get extra money for, uh, for bringing those items, which I really, really like. Is there a ghost back there? I come exercise you. Come to me. Come here, spirit. The ghost has left. Where did you go? Hello? They also worked a lot on the sound, I think, because there used to be a lot of janky sound issues in this game where the ghost footsteps would play on top of your character. So no matter where the ghost was running, you'd just hear it like walk under your feet, which was very weird and distracting and not very helpful. Any ghost? I'm trying to find you. How far could you have gone? Do you not want to attack me? I do- I do really miss the fact that the ghosts don't have names in this game. I really want to, like, yell at the ghost in a personal way, but they're just, like, entity. Which, I don't know, just makes me lose some personal connection with the ghost. I really like the naming feature of- or, like, the naming idea in Phasmo is so genius. Yeah, this is just Thomas Thomas. There- is there public match game matchmaking in this game already? I don't tend to really- play in that way come to me spirit there's a cat i am not getting anything it's a very it can be a very slow paced game if the ghost doesn't attack you actively 
Which it doesn't definitely is not doing right now, but that's kind of fun about it too. Can be a bit unfortunate that you have to like refine the ghost if you Oh there it is! Uh, zero attempts, zero attempts. Okay. Come here, bitch! Follow me! Yes, follow me to my equipment. That's exactly what I want. So a really kind of cheesy strategy in this game that's very effective is to bring the ghost to the truck and then just immediately grab all the items you need from the truck and then instantly get all the evidence. I'm not really going to do that here. I'm going to drop this. Where are you? Can you speak? Can you talk? Leave. Can you hear me? Okay, so it said leave. That's uh, another evidence. It's very, very good. We got two evidences already. I think you only have two to three evidences on this uh, on this difficulty that I'm playing. So we might be able to start the exorcism soon here. You will read the title. I don't know. I was just very focused on the game. Um, okay, so we're gonna fill in what we got. We have no EMA five. Uh, we have Spearbox EVP. That's what this is called. Um, so Spearbox EVP, and then the temperature near the ghost was zero. Um, I think I'm actually gonna start with the exorcism now. We need to burn an instant stick, stick close to the entity. We need to recite the the book, which is cool, and we need to flash the entity. Okay. Okay. So we need to grab... I'm first going to swap out my crucifix because this one might already be almost done, which I don't want to die. Um, we're going to recite the, the book. Shall we do that? You who haunt this place in the name of the Lord, I command you to go back where you... Wait. You who haunt this place in the name of the Lord. Hello. You who haunt this place in the name of the Lord. Is it broken? Oh, I'm not inside? This is not- Oh, I see. You who haunt this place in the name of the Lord, I command you to go back to where you came from. May your soul return to the earth. May your body return to the dust. So be the will of the Lord. <sighs> Got him. That's our first evidence step done. You hear the, like, explosion? That's, uh... Because we did one of the evidence steps, or one of the exorcism steps. So we did that, we have read the book, now we need to flash it with this cam. Uh, where is it though? Hello! Spirit! It, it exploded like somewhere over here, didn't it? So it might be around here. Come to me! I come exercise you! Any shadows? There it is. Flash it! Get fun! Wait. Why didn't it explode in the dust? Wait, is that good? Alright, got it. I think the shadow step is to flash it, so that must have worked. Okay. We did that. Now we gotta do the incense stick, which might be the last thing, unless we miss an evidence, which we could totally miss an evidence, which is fine. Then we'll just have to do... Uh, another step. Let's find it, though. I think I activate this by pressing F or, like, clicking. I don't exactly remember. I come exercise you, Shadow. What the fuck? Where? Where? My heartbeat just went off the charts. I come exercise you! Where did it come from? I'm gonna turn on these lights. Does that even help? Jesus, it's so bright. Hello? Shadow? Come to me. What the fuck are these noises? <laughs> it turned off the light. Wait, it, so it must be here then. Shadow? Because shadows don't like the light, I think. Yeah, they're just creaking over there for no reason. Are you in this building? Come to me, Shadow. Attack me. It's very bright. I come extra- There you are. There you are. You're all the way back there. Okay, go, 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 go. We gotta burn the stick. You're back to the ghost room. 
Here it goes. Is this gonna be it? Wait, fuck, I dropped it on the ground. Where are you? Where are you going? Hey! I don't- How the fuck do you light this shit? Oh, there, I did it. Fuck. Fuck, I messed it up! I- I- I toggled it into my inventory as- As I was holding it, so it went out immediately. <laughs> I have more, though. It's fine. Oops. <laughs> Lady name, I think even the 10 months. Oopsie. I, I forgot the controls for that. <laughs> Jesus! Oh, it's here. It's banging on the door. Get it. Get the incense stick. Go, go, go. Are you here? Go back! Did it run back? Are you back to your ghost room? Spirit, come to me. It is very hard to see the full geometric light. <gasps> Spirit, come to me. The final step of the exorcism. We have not found a cursed item yet. You know what we could actually do? I should probably swap out this crucifix. Uh, once you get rid of the ghost, you're actually going to get rid of the cursed items as well. Like the, the occult items. Um, because the ghost is gone. There's no more spirit energy in the map or whatever the fuck. Um, so we're going to have to find those before we get rid of the ghost. So I think I'm going to actually wait with exercising it we can also do some objective um we can some of these are very hard to do this one you have to aim it at the ghost and then get a, a thermometer reading off of it this one kind of doesn't work most of the time it's very buggy um i don't know if they fixed it maybe, maybe they already fixed it uh and the occult reading should be doable uh let's go grab an occult reader occult sniffer oh yeah they used to be called occult sniffer but now they're called occult meters which is much less cool. So I just dropped it on the ground. Oh, I don't have a crucifix. I almost went in without anything. That was very dumb. Let's grab a crucifix, shall we? We need that. And we want the occult sniffer. It'll always be a cold sniffer in my book. So we're gonna run a uh, run uh uh and find try and find an item that will make this uh a cold meter spike up and then we'll bring it back to the truck for extra money after the quest is gone or done you do not want to die though because that way you lose your money the sniffer i really like i think it's turned on no items here maybe it's in the Ooh. I was attacked for a moment there, but then it was gone. It's hard to... F I, I forgot how hard it is to keep track of the ghosts in this game. They're very mobile. They just run around the map, and they're very hard to find. Um, I don't know if there's some, like, rhyme or reason to their actions. I think they just kind of run around like crazy and then attack you sometimes. It's very hard to follow. Oh, here we go. Is it this? It's not that. Is it the beer bottle? I can't even pick that up, so it probably isn't that. Is it the cursed chair? The whole chair is cursed. Wait, no, it's not. Wait, what is cursed? Is it the plant? Wait, what the fuck? The iron? Wait, what's cursed here? I can't pick up the beer bottle. There's no way it's this, right? I can't pick this up. This item is not loose. It's stuck to the table. Oh, it's invisible! Of course, there's invisible items too. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so I forgot about that. There's actually invisible items. Look! Wait, where's it gotta be? There's an invisible fucking chair here! Look! There's a whole chair that we can't see, but it's in it's invisible. It's right here. So I can I can take a photo of that, which will give me uh Wait, it didn't give me money! What? Shouldn't they give you money? I'm pretty sure that should give you money, no? Oh, I guess not. Yeah, weird. All right, so we're gonna have to grab a flash camera. Also, we're gonna have to turn that guy off. 
Uh, now we have to grab a flash camera to make that item appear. And then we can bring it to the truck. So let's see. This is like, a, the, I really like this mechanic of cursed items. It really feels like, I don't know. It really feels satisfying to collect them. I love it. Miss Foxes, thank you for the, or Foxes, thank you for the two months. We're gonna use the, I think there's one more photo left on this. So we're just gonna use this guy. We're gonna flash it. You're really confused. This game is uh, can be a bit confusing. Well, we're doing very well. We have not died, which can be difficult. Let's make it appear, shall we? I do have a crucifix here. We're gonna flash it. That is not working as intended. And now it's out of photos. God damn it. The angle of it is so specific. That's so annoying. All right, we're gonna have to grab another one. <laughs> That's fine, we got more. <laughs> It should have worked, but the angle is quite specific sometimes. Why are you just... <gasps> Stop it. Jesus. Alright, we're spawning in another one. Way too much. We're grabbing another instant cam. This one is mine. This one is actually upgraded at us five photos instead of the standard one who has like There she is. I could I could exercise. Wait, wait a minute. Okay. Let's actually try exercising now that we know where this ghost is because we the invisible item will st you can still pick it up later, right? So let's try Oh, the ghost already gone? What? It was there for like a second. Where did you go? What the fuck? The ghosts are like so so like slippery in this game. It's very difficult to find them. This is Phasmophobia. Did you read the title of the stream? The game is in the title and in the game category. It's very hard to miss what game this is. <laughs> but yeah, reading is difficult sometimes. Where did the ghost go? Come to me, spirit! I go oh, there you are! Uh... Does that work? There you go. Okay, so that wasn't the final step, but we did actually get it. So that's perfect. Um, we have to collect one more piece of evidence and then we can uh, exercise the full ghost. So now we have to uh, get some more equipment item. We are not done yet. We're not done yet. We're going to have to grab uh, the writing book. And I'm going to also drag this one along. Let's turn that on. Okay, here we go. The ghost comes close. This might start giving a signal. Oh, come on. I can't sprint with this. Is this too heavy? Come to me, spirit. I come exercise you. But yeah, this is kind of like a medium map. It's, it's pretty big. Maybe even a large map compared to the rest. So we're, we'll go to a smaller map after this. I just wanted to see the newest map. Um, can you give us a sign? It threw something. Spirit, come to me. Oh, wait, it's actually working. The ghost is here. What the? Where? Th hey, come back. Spirit, come to me. Oh, I'm just going to stand here. Pretend like nothing is wrong. The ghost is literally around us because we're getting a reading on this. But that's fine. There's a ghost, but she's not killing me, so it's fine. Get the signal. And... INL120. Okay. Uh... Entity scan is I here one N L one twenty. What is that gonna give us? We have to uh, bring a tiger eye stone in contact with the entity. You can even throw the stone directly at the entity or place it on the ground to be walked over like a trap. Okay, so we have a tiger. We have to do a tiger eye. Let's go. 
spirit, come to me. This should be the... This should be the last exorcism step, as far as I know. Face cam gone? What happened? Wait. Wait, did this just happen, or has it been this way for a while? Wait, what happened? <laughs> did it just die? Wait a minute. Is my cam, like, out of battery? Let me see. Just happened now? Okay. Oh, no! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, I'm gonna have to do the... I think I'm gonna... I don't know. I think the game ran out of battery. <laughs> Oops. I need to get... I couldn't get it. Like, this, there's this thing that my cam has where you can connect it directly into the power outlet. But I haven't been able to get it for the longest time because it's always out of stock. It's so annoying. And I haven't checked that in a while, though. I should probably try and find it again. Let's, uh... Let's get the, uh, tiger eye. We're gonna... I, I'll, I'll turn my cam back on in, like, a few minutes, but it just needs to charge a little bit. If I turn it on right now, it's gonna turn back off immediately. Uh, give me a second. Put a stick, put, here. Wait, I'm dead. Wait, I'm dead! Oh my god, I was almost gonna... I was almost gonna die! Run over the fucking landmine, you bitch! There you go, we did it! <laughs> we did it, we exercised the ghost. I'm so scared. Let me turn that off. I can turn it back on, but if I turn it out back on right now, it's gonna run out of battery like instantly again. But let's just uh, it should turn on any moment now. There we are. We're back. Let's hope it stays this way. So we have exercised the ghost now. Sorry for the cam lag. <laughs> that was weird. I need to bring um. So there's no more ghosts in this place. It is completely gone. Uh, you can't actually collect any more um cursed items now, except the ones that are invisible, because those will still stay invisible, so you can still find them. Uh, so we're still gonna collect our one chair here. Let's go. We'll grab our photo cam and try and get it. Bring back the sticker. Oh, damn. <laughs> I am obsolete now. I can just put a, a random face up there. Can this chair please work now? That it be lovely. Come on. There you go. See, it's just, it's just a little finicky. But now there's a chair. Can we take a photo of that and get money? That should count. No? There's something. I think this is bugged. I'm pretty sure this should have counted as a cur- Maybe because it, I can't get the photo anymore because I exercised the ghost. I think that's what's happening. But anyway, I can still get money for this. It never counts after the exorcism I see. Okay, so this is actually my fault. Let's keep going. We're gonna go to the small map now. We have correctly exercised the ghost in my first attempt. I didn't die. That is very cool. The map looks awesome. It's a little big, uh, given that the ghosts run around so much. It's very difficult to keep... Okay. It's very hard to keep track of the ghosts. I did that, by the way. I found a new button on my keyboard. It makes a... It makes a T sound. <laughs> it makes it. A... <laughs> Can I go in here? All right. There you go. Let's leave. We have done it. Have I filled everything in? I think you get money now for filling it in, so we should... Yes, I filled everything in. Let's get out of here. Nice. Yeah, that is the global comm button. <laughs> That's pretty difficult. That was a difficult quest. What is the money gonna be? We got, uh... We did got the evidence. We found the... Uh, we took photo... Wait, let me go through this. So the main goals were collecting the evidence, check. Uh, entertaining the ghost, check. Exercising it, check. Uh, I didn't do many secondary goals because they're very they're pretty difficult to do. I did one, though, an EMF of level 2, uh, plus 8. We had photos of the dread room and the ghost itself. Uh, and we collected one occult item, which gave 10. So we got a hun 189. That's a lot more money than I remember. Oh, and the map actually gave me a big bonus as well, because it was a big map. I got uh, a lot. I got bonus money and experience there because it was a bigger map. That's cool. Cool. All right. So that was our that was our uh, first time on the new map. 
I think we have visited most of the other maps. I think we're going to go, before we go to, like, the, the, the other very big maps, like the Barony is cool, the Bamboo Temple is, is recently added. I think we're going to go to the classic, uh, the Lost House, to have a quick little quest, just to check out some more, and then we'll go to another big map. We got to spice it up. Let's go. Dopamine salad, thank you for the three months. The Lost House. This is, like, the best designed map uh, in the game, in my opinion. Have a good one, Wiki. I immediately heard a door. Spooky. All right, here we are. This is the Lost House. This is like the coolest map. I really love this one. Let's investigate, shall we? We need to find the ghost first. We need to figure out what type it is so we know what uh, equipment to bring with us. Hopefully, it's going to be a ghost that I can repel with the crucifix. Because if you have to use the Mary statue, it gets a lot more spicy. Oh, they really reworked the lighting. It looks so much better now. Ow. It threw something. That's very white light. It threw something over here. I think. Hello? Any ghost? Oh, the slate is. <laughs> oh. Also like that the. Oh, it threw this. I also like that the the houses are very dilapidated. Like they're very just ran down abandoned it's cool any ghost here i think i'm gonna bring um i'm pretty sure the ghost should be in the kitchen i want to quickly grab something to detect the ghost we're gonna grab a, a cold reader and the cam so we can see the orbies. Now I can run back to this in case I'm in danger. Oh, oops. So I don't actually have to hold the crucifix right now. All right, there's orbies here. Yeah, the ghost is, this is the ghost room. Okay. Leave that there. But that doesn't mean the ghost has to be here. <laughs> What? Ghost! What does it look like? I didn't see it. Oh, there you are! What the fuck? It's it's a ghost. It's a poltergeist or a demon? Poltergeist or a demon. Okay, run. Stay back. Stay back, I tell you. Okay, so this... I mean, if it's here, I might as well just figure out if it's one of these... Okay, I guess it's already gone. Are you here? Where are you? Can you speak? Let's grab another crucifix. I'm actually surprised my camera's still active. I'll take it. Um, okay, let's go in there. We don't need any more Mary statues because we already know that it is a poltergeist. Uh, or a poltergeist or demon. One of the two. Can you speak? Can you hear me? Can you talk? <laughs> that is actually a special evidence that you only get for demons. The demons can laugh. Can you hear me? <laughs> there you go. It's a demon. So the laugh will... Here, it even says it in the book, I think. Okay. Let's just keep going, I guess. Um, the demon, the, the, this demonic and aggressive entity will watch you around every corner, waiting for the best time to launch its attack. The demon can laugh at your impending doom, and its laughter is the best way to identify it. So that counts both as laughter and as ghostly voice on sight. So we already have one. We also have, uh, this right here. The scanner is going. I guess I'm just gonna stand still, because if I move, the ghost might also move. Shit! Did I finish it? I didn't finish. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's right there. Fuck, man. Did you finish the scan? DXE900. All right, go. Stay back. Give me EMF. Do it, you little bitch. Oh, Jeebus. <laughs> oh, we already got two. Nice. Okay, we need to film it. Let's try and film it, shall we? So the, way the filming I never understand. 
You just place a video cam? Like, let's place it in the ghost room, right? Let's place it over here. And see if we can eventually film this ghost. I, I don't really... I don't know how to make that work. Can you go into the vent? If the door is broken down, yes. Which is a very scary situation to be in. You don't want to... You don't want to have that happen. Let's turn this on. The orbs are right there. <laughs> that orb was just mega bouncing. You see that? Oh, wait. We got it. Nice. It actually worked. Record the video camera. Oh, it's supernatural interference. That's all we have to do now? They made it simpler. I think they made it simpler. So, we... This is a supernatural interference that's happening right now, which happens when the ghost is close. So, we did that one. Record an error reading on the thermo. We can do that, too. Wait, we can actually get all of them. Let's get the thermo up. Um, so we have DXE900, right? Let's fill that in before it's too late. Or before we forget. Not too late. DXE900. Now, this might be all the evidence we get. Because there's, I think, two to three. Yeah, two to three pieces of evidence. Um, so what we have to do is... Oh, this is a very simple one. Instant camera and reciting the book. That's all we have to do. Okay. Let's uh, try this, though. We're going to grab another crucifix. Give me this. Crucifix and try to get the arrow readings. You have to get this by pointing it at the ghost and then like point doing a reading. Hello? Stay back! Where is it? It's attacking me, but I can see it. What the fuck? Flicking the lights over there. Come out of that room, you coward! I want to check some cur some cursed item. What are you doing? Why is it blinking? Why is it? Oh, there you are! Oh, it's zero attempts. Mm. Stay back! Stay back! Did I get it? It's so hard to get. All right, let's, let's have you be there, and then I shoot the arrow reading, right? I got it. Okay, I got it. Nice. Let's go. Oh, thank you guys. Welcome, Raiders. Ghost guy, thank you for the raid. How are you guys doing? Thank you for the... Oh, happy birthday wishes. <laughs> I'm gonna flash you. I think I have to flash the ghost. Get flashed up. Okay, the ghost left. <laughs> thank you, guys. Thank you for stopping by. We did all the objectives. Look at us go. We're carrying. Um, okay. We need to flash it and we need to recite the book. And we need to do something else because we got another piece of evidence. We got that it's zero temps near the, uh, near the entity. Before we do that, however, I want to collect a cursed item. So we're going to grab the occult meter. And we're going to try and find a cursed item. The, welcome, everyone. Welcome, Raiders. Hope everyone had a lovely time over at Kai. The ghost is here, which is not very nice. Aha! Is it this one? This nut. Is there an invisible item or is it this teapot? It is the teapot. Let's take it with us. This is ours now. We still prefer sniffer. Me too. Me too. Okay, so we got that. I'm actually going to take a photo of that as well. And we're going to spawn in our photo cam. This one has extra photos, I think. No, it doesn't. Okay. Let that one count. That one did count. We also need to get a photo of the ghost. So how about we do that? Well, I have a photo cam in here, right? I don't have to do this. I'm just going to grab the photo cam that... If you bring... Uh, the way that you lose equipment in this game is actually very cool. Uh, if you bring in items into the map and then you die, you only lose the items that are in the map. Like, outside of the truck, anything that you left in the truck will not be lost. So that way you can... Uh, I don't know. It's, you can make sure that you don't lose too many items. Because this game is very brutal. The ghost should be around here because it's getting the signal. What the fuck is going on? Wait, it's literally standing right there. What the hell is wrong with me? Okay. Let's go. But what if you lose the truck? Uh, I don't think that happens. 
Let's get her another item. We got a ghost photo, right? Yes, good, 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 good. We want to get as many, as much money as possible. I really like the completionist in this game. Like, it's hard to get like a perfect game. In Ghost Underscore, you have a lot of different things you can do. Like, you can, you can do, you can do a super long mega investigation where you get all of the cur all of the occult objects. You get a bunch of photos. You get all kinds of cool stuff. Or you can do a very short one where you just exercise the ghost and you call it done. I like that difference. Is it this chair? Nope. It's a little hard to figure out what exactly the, uh, the cold sniffer is detecting. Wait, it's on this. Aha, uh -huh. is it invisible? I think it might be invisible. Let's grab the photo cam. Is there a ghost there still? I don't know. It is invisible. There's a knives, invisible knives. Can you get this photo? I swear you could. Oh yeah, you used to be able to, and it was just bugged last game, I guess. Okay, so this time we actually got it. Um, that's good. Let's get the flash. Let's get another crucifix. Our flash cam. There it is. Another crucifix. Thank you. And let's make that item visible. How many photos do you need to get a perfect game? Well, you can only take, uh... Oh, shit. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Stay back! Stay back, you demon! Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Flash him! Get fucked! Also, get this item! Nice. You can, like, fight. That's that's the main difference. This one is very much... It's not very... There's not a lot of tension unless you play on one of the bigger maps. On the bigger maps, there can be tension, but it's it's mostly just action. It's like... What the fuck was that like? It's like attacking the ghosts. You're, like, attacking each other, which is... Which is a very different take on, on the ghost hunting concept. Uh, it's more ghost busting than it is ghost finding. Like, not a lot of this, uh, of the game is built around you slowly figuring out, like, what ghost type you're dealing with. And every ghost has different behaviors. No, they're all pretty much the exact same. They just look different, um, and are, ver are have, like, different forms of aggressiveness. That's kind of the main change. Um, okay. So... We got a few items. I think there might be one more in there. Um, but I think we're gonna recite the exorcism book now. I'm actually gonna grab my own one because it has a little light in it. It's much cooler. Mine is cooler than the one you get for free. Look at this. Look at this. It has light in it. You who haunt this place in the name of the Lord. I command you to go back to where you came from. May your soul return to the earth. May your body return to the dust. So be the will of God. Do you have to say it? So be the will of the Lord. It used to say, so be the will of God, and what's much cooler? So be the will of the Lord. <laughs> so, there you go. <laughs> That's lol. It attacked me right as I read the final night. <laughs> Leave that there. I think I just spawned in a crucifix, but th that's there's no reason not to spawn like a billion of them every time you go in. Okay, so we only need to do one more step, which is the incense stick. Uh, however, first we want to do one more quick check to see if there's one more cursed item we can pick up. Because it's very satisfying for me to, ooh, to pick up more of these. Leave me alone, you monster! Run! Stop it! Jesus, leave me alone, man! Wait, did the door just fucking disappear? What even happened? What is this? It's a nice glitch. Hey, Psycho, what's up? 
I've actually not been dying. I haven't died a single time. I mean, I'm also playing on, like, easy, but I'm a little bitch. Game's hard, okay? <laughs> Is there any cursed item? Or have I already found all of them? Maybe I have found all of them. I think I might have found all of them. So I think we're going to do the uh, final step of the exorcism now. Oh, no. There's something here. Wait a minute. Is it on the stairs here? Oh, it's right here. Invisible? Or is it the... It's the tricycle. Cursed tricycle. Well, now... It's haunted. It's mine. If you press like R to rotate it, yes. Go with us. All right. Now we're going to finish the exorcism, which we needed to touch it with an incense stick. Shouldn't be too difficult, given that this ghost really, really liked to attack me. Come to me. I come exercise you. Attack me, you fiend. What the heck? Kind of creepy. <laughs> uh, there you are. Take this. Yes! Let's go. Nice. We did it. Easy peasy. Another ghost has been beaten. Busted, as they say. Nice. Good stuff. We've been doing really well. And we got a ton of extra cursed items this time. So, And we did all the objectives. Let's see how much money we get. Let's see how much money we get. Last time we got 189. Let's see it this time. Very cool. That was a real fun game. Yeah, I, re I, th I think the smaller maps are generally better uh, for this game because if you're on a big map, it's like there's lots of just wandering around. Very hard to find the ghost. Um, let's see. We made... So we got all of this, which is the standard, like if you do everything. Then we had all of the all of the objectives, which is eight for each. We took a photo of the dread room, which is 16. Cursed object, the ghost, the dread room is actually 16. Nice. Invisible cursed object is eight. Uh, we took, wait, six times? We only took like three. Is this bug still in the game? They never fixed this? There used to be, well, there is still a bug, apparently, where if you take, like, a few random items, like, a few cursed items, you get, like, a ton of cursed items. Like, I only took three cursed items, but it counted to six. I don't know how. So, yeah, I, I technically took six cursed items back, which doesn't make any sense. Maybe it, like, spawns. Maybe it just picks, like, a cursed item randomly on the map, and it can, like, pick the same item twice. Sometimes that might be, I don't even know, man. Um... Yeah, we got more money. We didn't get any bonus money for the map because the map is just a small one. But we did get 221 um, money, which is more than the last time. So that was awesome. Let's go to... Okay, so there... I really want... I think I'm going to go to the cemetery. The cemetery of the last rest. Let's go. Let's do it. It counts to tricycle wheels? <laughs> Are you serious? That's so stupid, and I love it. <laughs> Let's see. We're gonna go to the cemetery. Spooky. The pink one. Thank you for the $10 donation. Thank you. It is a spooky cemetery. All right. Here we are. Ooh. The lighting is different. Let's go grab our basics. Yeah, so my main complaints with this game is that the 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 fence mechanics in this game are way too binary It's like if you have the right item you're completely safe all the time every single time nothing can happen to you If you don't have the right item you are absolutely doomed. There's nothing you can do to survive. I I don't like that I like it to be there should be somewhere in between right it should it should be There should be like a spectrum of defense where you can I don't know it shouldn't be so black and white where you're either just completely safe or completely dead. There should be a little bit more that the player can do to, like, make it more engaging. Um, 
And then the other thing is that the ghost doesn't really feel like it may... It, it doesn't really feel smart. It feels very, very stupid. I, I don't know if anyone else has played this game and, and felt that way, but I feel like the ghosts are just kind of like, oh, oh, I'm just walking around. I'm a dummy. I'm an idiot. Oh, we lost me again? All right. <laughs> Oops. Let me turn it off. Uh, we'll have our replacement. There you go. I'm still there. I just, I'm just locked. I, I, you know what your parents say that you like, you shouldn't you just take, make, you shouldn't make that funny face when the clock hits uh, 12, it'll st get stuck that way. That's what happened to me. My face got stuck that way. <laughs> but we have to wait like one minute and then I turn it back on and then we should be good for the rest of the time. And then I'll make, I think what happened is that I left my camera on for way too long. I like left my camera on overnight, so it ran out of battery during the night. Oopsie. And I'll, I'll look back into getting like a, an outlet attachment because that's what I ultimately should be using. I shouldn't be using the battery at all, but that's just because I couldn't get that. Also, I can't get this ghost. <laughs> there is a ghost. It's a demon. Can you hear me? Can you speak? Can you talk? Why are you fucking twerking? What the hell are you doing? Why are you twerking? This ghost is fucked up. Alright, I'm gonna hide this now. It's probably distracting. <laughs> the ghost is twerking. Uh, I just clipped and everything. So it should be a ghost that I can... Br uh, that I can Hello? Uh, a uh, rude? Thank you very much. Leave me alone. I don't even need a flashlight on this map, I don't think. This map seems like it's very easy to, like, find the way without using a flashlight. So we're not going to use a flashlight. We're just going to grab a crucifix. Uh, hang on. Can you hear me? <laughs> okay then seems like we have another demon here oh, that's not what i want to do also i'm back uh stay back where are you Dude! get away from me it's not freezing here no no You don't even need to see me to know my expression. <laughs> Am I that predictable? Probably. Come back here. I need to take a photo of your face. You see how fucking aggressive this ghost is? He just doesn't leave me alone. Are there Orbeez here in the middle? Yes. Orbeez here in the middle. Dread room photo. Did that count? A two star. Was I not close enough? Damn it. Any invisible items? Uh, hello? Uh, let's just go. Let's just go. Three, I don't know. I don't know how the, the, the many money thing works. It's just weird. Okay, here it goes. Should probably hold the crucifix in the offhand. I'm gonna drop this in the ghost room. Can I turn this off? Because we already know it's that. I'm gonna leave this here. And this too, I guess. And now let's get some more. Oh, do you see has the sill right now? Nice. Yeah, I think this game is like... It's uh, it's real fun to play a few times and get like, it's real fun to, the, the way that this game is fun is that it's so hard that you can't really get an exorcism your first few games. Like you'll have to learn a lot of the game mechanics before you can get an exorcism. Um, I guess if you know that how the crucifixes work, you'll be mostly safe. I think that's the main thing to like keep in mind. Uh, and then once you get exorcisms, it's just satisfying to do that. Uh, my face cam is back on. I, I did realize that I, I that just doesn't happen randomly. I did that. Um, 
EMF, error reading, anything we need to do? I think we've used most of our evidence. Um, let's get the... Let's drop this and get a new one. It's gonna turn off real soon here. Sorry, it's just that the battery is almost empty, so it just keeps running out. Like, it charges slower than it uses the power. Uh, and that's why it's like this. Any ghost, I come exercise you. Come to me. Oh, you got... It's standing on the table. Air reading, give it to me. Does it not fucking work? Why it's working? What the fuck is happening? It's EMF 5, right? Is it? Yeah, it's EMF 5. Can I get the stupid... What the hell? This ghost... Okay, we got the error reading. Jeebus. Right in the book, you stupid. Yeah, I got the error. The, the, the glitchy, like, movement of the ghost... The, the ghost models in this game are... Not very scary. <laughs> They're very janky. <laughs> Shut up! That's right. Fear me. We did all of the objectives, by the way. Look at us go. We have EMF5. So we have, um... Okay. We have a demon because we have the laughing again, right? So we're going to fill in demon. Demon. Then we have EMF5. Uh, temperature was normal. We have audio proof. Ghostly voice on site. This might just be the evidence. So we need to shoot it with the neutrino gun and the exorcism. Okay, here we go. That's spicy. Now, first of all, we're going to try and get another cursed item. Um, because it's actually quite easy to do that here. Uh, I'm even gonna just take, uh, the photo cam with me. to see if there's any invisible ones. Let's go. Let's find him. Maybe one of those skulls, is, skulls are cursed? Nope. Those are normal skulls. Those aren't cursed. Why do you have to keep changing the cross? Because the cross, if it runs out, you'll die. Because it will no, no longer repel the ghost. So I keep swapping out the cross so I never get caught into a situation where I'm being attacked by the ghost and then all of a sudden my crucifix breaks and then I get killed. Because, as I said, if you don't have a crucifix, there's nothing you can do to survive. There's barely anything you can do. You just, you just get murdered. You just die. We found one. So we know about this one. I guess I'm just going to leave them in the middle. It doesn't actually matter. We don't have to take this all the way back. I'm going to take this photo. Let's try and find another. Yeah, it's also a consumable. So if it runs out, it'll actually cost you money. And if you use too many crucifixes, like too many items during a run to consumables, you'll actually lose money on your quest. Like you'll, you'll get less money from exercising the ghost and you spend in consumables. So you need to be, you need to be careful with how many consumables you use. <laughs> what game is this? Read the title. Stop moaning, lady. There's a, an Easter egg right here, I think. Yes, let's find it. Uh, oh, it's walking over there. There is an alien skull. Boop. And now it's gone. Can I please get another cursed item? There's gotta be one more, right? It's the EMF is going crazy. The ghost is right there. You see it? I love it. It's a spooky. Where's the cursed item? I guess there might just be one. Wait, where did the skulls go? Oh, he threw the skulls over to me. Interesting. All right, I don't think there is anything else. So we're just gonna go. Uh, we're just gonna sh l like flash the ghost. Bring this back. Uh, we need to recite the book. And then we need to use the uh, neutrino gun. Which is gonna be very cool. That's gonna be sick. There you go. Uh, neutrino gun and reciting the book. Let's recite the book first. Wait, didn't we already do this? 
No, we didn't do this, right? Here we go. You who haunt this place in the name of the Lord. I command you to go back to where you came from. May your soul return to the earth. May your body return to the dust. So be the will of the Lord. That's right, bitch. Did I get a ghost pick already? I think I did, didn't I? Oh, I didn't. I didn't. Good call, good call. Let's take that picture before we blast this ghost into oblivion. Also, I need to grab another crystal. Let's go. Hello, ghost. I am a friendly ghost hunter. I will friendly exercise you. Where are you? Come here! I come exercise you, you little bitch. Where are you? Got the photo. Should have counted? Yep. Alright, I'm gonna leave this here. We're gonna neutrino zap you! It is time for you to leave this mortal realm and go to the spirit whatever the fuck. Do it. He just... He just poofed out of existence. He dodged my gun. Well played, ghost. <laughs> he just juked me. Come here. I come exercise you. You little shit. Come here. I am ready for you. Attack me. Spirit. Oh, we need to be careful. Where's the ghost? Spirit, I come exercise you. Hello? Spirit? Where the spirit? Isn't there a photo cam here? Oh, 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 there you are. Okay, perfect. Grab this. Zap it! On the altar! Wait, that wasn't enough! Okay, so we actually missed a, we missed an evidence then. Wait, interesting. What is it then? Can you write in the book? Write in the book, spirit. Write in the book. Spirit, write in the book. Can you write in the book? What would the last evidence be? I actually don't know, because I checked this, I checked that. Wait, this... Can you speak? Can you talk with me? What? <laughs> Excuse me? What the fuck was that? Oh, wall drawing, you're right. Maybe there's wall writing. You are totally right. Wait, that's totally gonna be it and I wanna find it too because it's cool. All right, we're gonna go. We're gonna go try and find the wall writing. I forgot that's a thing. Forgot about that. Okay, Um. yeah, yeah, I don't want that. So we're gonna grab a photo cam for that and try to find it. It might be invisible. There's writing that can be writing on some of the graves, I think. I don't actually know where it could be. This looks kind of difficult to find. Where would it be? Yeah, it can be invisible. That's why I have the cam. If we find it, there's... Let's see. This is the one thing that I've always kind of... I know people don't like it when I say this word, but I've always kind of cringed at this one part of this game. I find it so cheap. I don't know if they did it intentionally. They must have. Um, I don't know if we're going to find it, though. I just said the word. I'm sorry. Oh, no, it's here. We got wall drawing. Look. There you go, boom. Wall drawing. That's so cool. Um, no, the one thing that I really don't like about this game, and I don't know why they, it feels so, it, I don't know. It feels very weird, but they use the, the, the same font as the Phasmophobia logo for like wall writing, which I find just, there's so many spooky fonts. Just use your own font, come on. That just, that, that's never sit right with, set right with me. <laughs> Cause it's like, come on, man. That's just, that's just, that's just weird. All right. Well, okay. It's time for you to die. We got the wall drawing. 
Uh, let's fill it in. What is it? Written evidence, drawing in the book, writing in the book, writing on the surface, draw. There you go. What do we need to do for that? We need to throw holy water on the entity. Let's do that. I'm actually going to grab two holy water in case I miss the first one. Attack me! There you are. Take this, you bitch! I missed. Take this! There you go. <laughs> that, that's why I brought two. <laughs> because I knew I'd miss the first one. Nice. This is so, so good, man. I I haven't played these games in way too long. They're very satisfying to complete. Like, we got a cursed item. We got the wall writing. It's fun. And we did all the objectives. Let's get out of here. Let's see how much money we got. And then go to, I think, like, one more map. We'll do one more map. Uh, this is a new map. I think there's there's been uh, quite a few new maps in this game. Uh, I haven't really covered it much recently. We got all of that, as usual. All of that as well. We had Dreadroom Photo gave 24 this time. What the hell? Five from the cursed object, ten from the ghost, five from the uh, surface drawing, and only one cursed item this time. Still 211 because we got some bonus from the map. Very cool. Very nice. Did I even level? I didn't level up. I'm level 44. Very high level. We're gonna go. So we went to the Lost House. This one is one of the biggest maps in the game. It's a huge fort. This manor I've visited many times. If you want to watch any... Uh, there's I have like a play, uh, playlist of Ghost Hunters Core where I've played this game quite a lot. Uh, and I've played a lot on those maps because those used to be in the game. Uh, there's a few new ones though. The Barony, I think we're gonna go to the Bamboo Temple because it is the most different one of all. So let's go there and check it out. Let's go. Do, do, do. Okie dokie. We are on the bamboo temple. We're gonna grab our basic equipment, which is the Mary statue. I've been, I'm, we've been very lucky with only needing to use the crucifixes because Mary statues are actually harder to use. I don't know if you need a flashlight on this one. I don't think you do. I'm actually gonna drop the flashlight just so we can have the photo cam out for a little bit um, faster detection of the ghost. I think this is a pretty bright map. So that's a real upside from some of the outside maps that they're so bright that you don't actually need um, a flashlight at all, which makes you be able to carry another item. Look at this. It's just the temple. Do the bamboo still shake in this weird way? No, they fixed it. The bamboo used to like rotate in a circle. <laughs> Like, even in the ground, it was very weird. But now they do it normally. They fixed it! Yeah, I am just flying across- What the fuck? There's a ghost here! It's a shadow again! Stay back! Stay back, you monster! Okay, run. Nice! Another shadow. That's so lucky that we haven't had a child or a, pole or a revenant. I mean, most of the ghosts are stopped with crucifixes. So it's fine. Like, it's- you're most likely to get into this situation anyway. But for the Mary statue, you actually have to drop it on the ground. You can't just hold it. So it's much harder to get away from the ghost when it's attacking you because you have to, like, sit on top of the Mary statue. Um, we're gonna... I know. I, I just, It's just like a, a mo... Like, you need to get into used to this. I'm just gonna spawn a bunch so I don't have to spawn a few much. <laughs> and just mass-produce crucifixes. Anyway, we're gonna grab some, uh, some evidence items. They made it so you can hold the statue? Really? Oh, really? I didn't even know. Oh, they did. Oh, cool. Are you here? Can you speak? The, sh the, the bamboo noise. Can you speak? Can you hear me? Can you talk? Where are you? Can you speak? Can you hear me? What? Can you hear me? Dude, that's fucking cursed. 
I thought it was just gonna be a little goofy talker uh, behind you kind of stuff, but this is terrifying. Oh, that's voices in the house. <laughs> we got a shadow uh, and voices in the house. Do we have a temper? I'm just gonna leave this here and run. I can hear you. That was awesome. Okay. No, this ghost is Japanese. It's not French. Let's grab this, this, and we can even drag another one. So much inventory space. Efficiency, baby. I hope the ghost is still around here so I don't have to run all across the building. I do kind of wish the ghost would be more centralized so they pick like an area where they would stick around instead of like, like running around the whole map like crazy. Makes it hard to find them. Are you here? Oh, wait. Where's the ghost? Oh, there you are. Ema 5, Ema 4. I'm gonna have to drop this so I can walk out. It's Ema 5, okay. Ema 5. Can you write in the book? Can you write in the book? Spirit, can you write in the book? Okay, it's not this. The EMF is going fucking nuts. I need to run. Wait, let's check this. Okay, zero attempts. We have all the evidence. We have all the evidence. Zero attempts, EMF 5, and ghostly voice on site. That's all the evidence. There can't be more. Go, 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 go. I really, I, I feel like, I mean, maybe because I'm playing on the somewhat lower difficulties, but I don't feel like I have to camp the front area as much. That used to be a real problem with this game, where you just, like, kind of sit in one area, and the ghost would just come to you every time. You'd never have to move around the map. I like that it's... Uh, it seems to be easier to, to, like, go into the map without just dying. The crucifixes are very strong. Okay, so we have all the evidence. Let's fill it in. We have Ema 5. Um, we have zero attempts. And ghostly voice on sites. We have a shadow, which is all of this. We need to shoot the thing. I'm gonna do that last. Incense stick. Um, okay, let's do the incense stick and the flash right now. Did I swap out? I did swap out, right? That's cool. The incense stick. That's not what it's called, but I'll take it. Yeah, I haven't played GHG in a long time. I really want to play some more GHG. GHG and Obsidio. Uh, that was a little cursed. I come exercise you. Come to me, spirit. Or I will be your undoing. I'm gonna leave this here. And now I'm gonna go grab uh, an occult sniffer. And what else do we need to do? Like uh, reciting the book or something? What else do we need to do? We need to... Exorcism. Okay, let's, uh, let's grab the exorcism book. And the occult sniffer. Exorcism book. And an occult sniffer. Yeah, Obsidio has... The update for Obsidio has improved it so, so much in my eyes. Especially the graphic quality of the game has gone up like crazy in the last update. Um, you who haunt this place in the name of the Lord. You who haunt this place in the name of the Lord. Hello? Am I not in the house? Does this not count as inside? You who haunt this place in the name of the Lord. I command you to go back to where you came from. May your soul return to the earth. May your body return to the dust. So be the will of the Lord. <sighs> what the fuck was that ghost, Steven? All right. Uh, that goes. Easy. Let's find a cursed item, shall we? Any... Oh... There we go. Is one of these pillows cursed? It's the cursed pillow! Ah! Uh! <laughs> Rip cam again. It's fine. It, 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 we're almost done here. Sorry for the cam. Uh, I'll make sure it's charged for next time. Also... Oh, there you are. Wait, did I take a photo of this yet? I think I did. Aha! Another cursed... Oh. I should... I should honestly have a second battery. That would be like the easiest way to fix this when it happens. So then 
I think I can. Okay, I'll make sure it's fixed. Anyway, let's just focus on the game because I'm actually. This is so much fun. <laughs> It'll be fixed in a moment. Yeah, it doesn't happen often. It's just when I forget the charge for the stream, and then it like runs dry, and then it uses its power quicker than it charges, and then it starts doing this. But that's that's okay. VTuber modeling. VTubing is scary to me. What the fuck? It's stuck in the grave! Stay back! Alright. And I'm back. I should be back in a moment. Here. Camera anomaly! Report the distortion! You did it, you reported it. And the last one- is this one invisible? There is an invisible item. Good. We get an extra photo from that. No, no, no. Did I take a photo of this? I don't think I did. So we're taking a photo of this now. Then we have pretty much all the photos, I think. That is just a white screen, but apparently it's going to count. Okay. We don't have to bring them yet. We'll just have to focus on the rest of the exorcism now. Because we know where the items are, we can bring them back afterwards. You expected a potato. <laughs> yeah, VTubing is like what what Psycho does. <laughs> when he becomes a potato. We still need to get the error reading and record the disturbance. Well, let's do that. Hey, KCB, what's up? My cam is in there. I didn't... Fl I did, did I already flash it? I don't think I did. I'm just going to grab another one. Find it in. Come here, ghost. I have a bone to pick with you. A shaky noise. Hello? Any ghost? Come to me, ghost. Try and kill me, see what- Can you go through this? You can't go through that, sad. We should play, um... I don't know. I think tomorrow would probably not be the best time. I mean, I'm gonna stream tomorrow, but I'm expecting CJ and Psycho will probably not be playing tomorrow. But that would be, like, insane if we do it for New Year's, but... I'm probably busy doing other things. Oh, I don't have to bring these back yet. Wait. Perfect! Flash it! What the fuck even? Flash it! There we go. You have been fl I should have gotten the error reading! Fuck! Should have done that before. You would be- I- I would- What can I ask? Uh, I mean, I think CJ will probably be busy. CJ is more of a normal person. We're kind of crazy people. <laughs> CJ is, like, relatively normal. <laughs> Relatively, though. <sighs> Boom. And uh, what tells? I think we needed to do the as, all that's left now. Oh no, the incense stick. I I have that in the can in the in the building. And then we need to bring this as well. Imagine being normal. Yeah, I like the variety of maps. It's cool. It's cool. It's satisfying. It's really satisfying to get a full to get a full quest in this. I like the leveling system being pretty. It's very. I don't know. It's, get out of here! It's very. Um, what do you call it? What you call it? Uh, like exponential. Eventually, you can't really level up anymore. I really like in fast mode that it's just linear. Um, but I like the I like this the like uh, huge spectrum of gold you can get in this one. You can get like um, a ton of money if you play perfectly, or very little money if you just do a fast speed run. I really like that big difference, where playing 
well. It's not as, it's not like the easy, you don't get money in an easy way. Like you don't just take easy photos and then you get instant money. You can also get cursed or, or occult items. You can do all a bunch of optional objectives and there's a whole bunch of different way to get like extra money. Also, I didn't even show this yet. It's here, right? Get it. Okay. Anyway, that's the thing. <laughs> uh, let's grab the. I wouldn't. I wanted something. Oh yeah, a new crucifix. I think that's it, I guess. Oh yeah, a camera for the for the objective. Okay, how much is this game? I need it now. <laughs> you can use it on the ghost. Oh yeah, you can. There's a ghost. It's a coming. Stay back. Can I get the error reading you? It's so hard to get the shit. Did I get it already? What the fuck? I hope I got it. There's no way I didn't right? That would be ridiculous. You got it? Yeah, I hope. I did it for like a solid minute. Right? No! No, I didn't do it. Are you fucking joking? I was stood there. Shh. That is the most unlucky garbage. I didn't get it. I didn't get the error reading. It is like you have to catch him when he's like flat. Like, I don't know. That is ridiculous. How did I not get the, the camera though? I did, I kept spamming it. Yeah, absolutely. All right, come on, ghost. Where? Come to me, spirit. I come exercise you. It's getting near the feet. Okay, I'll try that next time. I come exercise you. Spirit, come to me. What the fuck? It's so weird. Oh, there you are. Wait, you're in here. Come out. It's dark in here. Come out, spirit. Attack me. Anyone here? Hello? Let me go grab the... Did we? Oh, I already grabbed the cursed item. It's right here. I guess I'll bring that... What the fuck? I just launched it. Wait, you can throw items in this game? Holy shit. Huh? Whoa, what the hell? <laughs> Jesus. That's a mega yeet. What the hell? Look at this. Huh? <laughs> That's so good. What if I throw it up? Like, will it just launch itself out of the... Huh? Oh, there it is. What the fuck? Who? Oh my god. <laughs> what? That's insane. The gravity on this item is crazy. Whee! Boom. <laughs> what the fuck? All right, that's beautiful. What a what a light vase. I already got three items in here. I do. Okay. Can I please get this? Please. It didn't shatter. No, it's a very strong... Fa it's Japanese quality, guys. Japanese phases don't shatter. We all know this. I should have turned on the stupid... I'm gonna leave this here. I should turn on this cam, because otherwise it doesn't mark the objective, I think. I think you have to uh, turn it on or it doesn't work. And he gets something out of bounds. Probably. Turn this on. Can there be a ghost, please? I see the orbs. But no ghost. New crucifix as well, yeah. 
I don't know if you have to be here to get the objective. That would make that would make kind of sense why I never got it. Um, I don't know. I'm just gonna go in. I'm not about to wait. We need to get the thermo reading and the uh oh there she, there you are. Come on. And obviously we need to finish the exorcism. Come back here! Don't run for me, you coward! Hey, come back. Wait, you can go through this? I can't do that. That's cheating. Hey, come back here. Hello? Spirit, come to me. Oh, yeah. What the actual fuck is this? I forgot about this. What is this path and why does it exist? Look at this fucking wave here. This makes no sense. This is the weirdest fucking path ever. <laughs> Why is it like this? <laughs> it's so dumb. I feel like they could have dug that out better. There you are. Oh yeah, just shoot it at the feet and you get it like pretty much instantly. Okay, thank you. Thank you, whoever said that. That is very helpful. I did it. Good. We just need to get the last uh, f film objective. I don't know if we're actually going to be able to do that. Jeebus, what the hell? We get to get my get my special gun. I, I wish we would have used the... I, I'll show you the salt shotgun. The salt shot shotgun is super cool. Look at this. Boom! Boom! <laughs> you have to shoot it with the salt shotgun sometimes. That's like a special objective. Is the ghost ever gonna return here? I don't think it is. I think we're just gonna go. This one objective is just eight dollars. We don't. I have a special gun that recharges uh, when you don't use it for a little bit. There it is. Wait, does that mark it? I'm just gonna assume it then or whatever. And go. Come here, ghost. Spirit, come to me. Holy shit, that actually gave me chills. I thought that was the ghost just standing there, but it's a fucking statue. <laughs> that got me good. Did I flash it already? I don't know if I did. Ghost, come to me! I did already flash it. Okay, that's fine. Joey Universe, thank you for the... What the hell? What's the shadow? Thank you for the sub. Alright, spirit, come to me. Wait. Oh, and now we need to burn the incense and then we're good. Come here. Yeah, I think I think I already did that or I didn't even need to do that. Come here, ghost. Spirit, come to me. Are you there? Can I go through this? It feels like there should be a path that goes here. I don't know why. Maya, they give it the four months. I don't. I don't know if there's like special strategies that I just don't know yet how to find the ghost, but like, it feels like the best strat is to just wait and then eventually it'll find you and then you'll just be good to go. Look at that tree. Oh, there it is. EMF, EMF going wild. Just a stick. Get. There you go, we got him, nice. That was good, that was a real fun run. So many fun runs. The first one was very slow. After every run after was, I mean, I just had to get, I just had to warm up, right? That was awesome. Thank you guys for all the hundred biddies, the hundred bitty train. Thank you, thank you. Beautiful, beautiful. We have done it, Maria. Thank you for the five gift subs. Thank you. Let's see how much money we get. We didn't actually get the camera. I don't know why, because the ghost was there, but it's fine. I think you have to. I think what what I did wrong is that you have to look. You have to turn on this cam. You have to look right here, and then it'll mark the objective. You can't just be outside of the truck and then have it, like, glitch out and then mark the objective. You have to actively be here looking at it. So, yeah. I don't know. It's fine. Let's go. Let's go. We have exercised them every single time. We haven't lost once. That was good. That was good. We saw a bunch of new maps. What is the money on this one? That isn't... Is that the most we've seen? 
today? Might be. Uh, we did all those things. We forgot one, or we didn't get managed to do one objective. We got much less for... Yeah, we got much less in terms of money this time. Like, in terms of money for photos. I don't know how the money for photos is calculated. It's a little weird. Is it based on the stars? I guess? I don't know. I felt like it took pretty good photos. Um... Because the last time I got 24 for the for the dread room. Oh yeah, the one time we had 221. Well, this is still very close. Uh, three occult items. We didn't. We we actually took three this time. No bug. No bugs there. Uh, and then a little bit of a bonus for the map. That was a very good one. That was Ghost Hunters Core. I know they are working on another update that's going to come out somewhere in early January. So maybe that'll come out soon and I can check out another update. Let me know if you want to see that. Uh, I like this game. I really like it. I've already said my main issues with this game is that the crucifixes and the Mary statues are just way too strong. And without them, you're just way too weak. There's like no other way to play besides holding the Mary statues and crucifixes. There's, and when you do that... There is really no way that you die. So it's kind of like the game is either way too hard if you don't know what you're doing and you don't know how the Mary's Touch and the Crucifixes work, or it's way too easy and there's like no danger whatsoever. There's kind of no, no in-between. I wish there was more of an in-between. They should really figure out a way to do that um, personally. That's my opinion. Um, I really like that there is so much for the completionist. Like if you'd like to go on a full-on ghost investigation in a large map, uh, there's a variety of map uh, maps as well. You can just do a whole bunch of things. You can go around the whole map collecting cursed I or occult items. Uh, you can finish all the objectives. There's lots to do for the completionist. Or you could just do a real quick, uh, quick game. Oh, the camera also disappears right as I'm doing my outro. That is unfortunate. Let's... <laughs> Sorry. It's going to be back hopefully for a few seconds here so I can say... <laughs> there we are. All right. So thank you very much for hanging out. Uh, this was Ghost on the Scroll. Let me know if you want to see more. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. And if you want to join the lovely game is here in chat, you can join us over at twitch.tv slash insim every single day at 7 p.m. Central European time. Thank you very much for watching. I love you, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye, guys. Bye-bye. Thank you so much for hanging out. That was fun.